Hi, I'd like to show you a new tool that I've discovered that will make vocabulary that you are not used to easy to understand. First, you're going to need to go and get a Google Chrome extension. And the Google Chrome extension is Read and Write. This is the image. And add it to your student or your teacher account for school. After you've added it, it will look like this symbol in your toolbar. And a helpful thing to do is whatever the tool is that you want to permanently be pinned to your toolbar, find it, this is it right here, and then select this pin so that it's always up there for you to access to get it. Um, this is what it looks like unpinned and this one is pinned. That's why I can see it right here in my toolbar. So then you go to the page that you need and you want to translate and you highlight a word. And one thing that you can use is right click. You can go to define cats and that will give you a dictionary version of it. You can also with this icon, you can have it show a symbol. So that would really elevate and make more simple your way of understanding the word. Um, I'm going to show you a more difficult one. And that would be like. And this is an example of what that shows. So it's more abstract and not concrete. Um, so abstract means it's more like an idea. Concrete would be like a thing, an object or a person. Okay, I hope that was helpful for you. Um, you can see in this toolbar that comes with the read and write a lot of other potential things too. So I'm going to highlight my whole sentence and I'm going to hit play. Cats are furry and like to sleep. Cats. So that's an example of that tool. And there are other ones in here that you can use. I just want you to translator is one that I've already shown you in the past through other tools, but these are all um, just different ways that can help you with your reading and writing, especially if English is not your first language. I hope this really helped.